Will you pray with me? Lord, you know that we love you. You know our thoughts and intentions. You know the depth of devotion found in our lives today. If our love has weakened, if our fervour has waned, turn us, Lord, by your Spirit's power. Let us love with love unfeigned. Father, I'm so grateful that you can read our hearts and probably know them far better than we do. Help us, Lord, this morning to be honest, to be honest before you, to be honest in the love and the grace of the Spirit that you pour over our lives. And if our love has wavered, if it has um, not been the love that you want us to have, it's not been the love that's been put into action in recent days or years, then, Lord, show us by your Spirit. Show us once again what it means for each one of us to love you, to, to physically show that to others in our, in our words and our deeds and our behaviours, in the way we live, in the way that we just serve those around us by a simple hello, by greeting people, by remembering others in their times of need, doing whatever you call us to do. Yes, we're human beings, but we are also called in a love for you to do something about that love. And so, Lord, I'm asking you this morning to, by your spirit, to, in each one of us, to... Help us reflect that in the lives that we would live for you. It might be a bit more difficult in the circumstances that we're living in currently, but it's not impossible. There are ways that you want us to do those sorts of things. And if we've made this an excuse, then Lord, forgive us and show us a new way. Show us a way to be your disciples. You've called us. We've confirmed who you are. We've admitted our failures and uh, you've transformed us, Lord, and, and you call us to do something about it. And so, Lord, I'm asking you this morning to do just that, that our hearts and our lives will be open, that we would turn our eyes to you in such a way that we would be your disciples in this place, wherever you have placed us. Thank you for the love of Jesus. Thank you that he, he loved us enough to die on the cross. Thank you that uh, he calls us again and again. Even when we fail, he will call us again. Help us to, with our, our heart to listen to that call and to respond in the love and the grace that you pour over us to be able to respond. Thank you, Lord, for it all. Speak to us this morning. We ask in the precious name of Jesus our Saviour and our friend. Amen and amen.